I see I'm pretty determined to get these red, but they just keep coming. So the thing is that this one, I have no idea what this is because it has no title. And uh, possibly it's a piece that's supposed to go with a second page that I don't have. Maybe it's the back page because it seems like there might be something that, that wasn't copied that was on the other side of it or something. So I'm going to call it its first sentence because I don't, I'm not sure if, if I find the other side, then obviously I'll just delete this. But anyway, I didn't want to just pass it by and throw it away because I, I don't at the moment remember where I was, when I wrote it, what it's about. But anyway, the name, the first sentence is smelling at last the freshness of day. I'll just call it the freshness of day, maybe, or something like that. Here's how it goes. Smelling at last the freshness of day, seen faintly for a moment, awakening to the harshness of humanity. Living is to be is to be shamed, beaten, belittled, ridiculed, raped, and tortured beyond recognition, repeating the fullest extent of the law, law, blinded by justice, freedom, liberty, knowing not of these, fleeing to find my mammy, she knew, accepting her fate, humbly dying, bewildered, God, had they captured you too? Weathered and wrinkled, my eyes filled, realizing it was too late for me. Hoping desperately in payment of time, justifying this inhumanity to our children, mixed by now the blood of many, praying they would, could fulfill my dreams and mammies. Finally now, finally, he would take me home, back to freedom. Hallelujah, free at last. I feel that I wrote that on behalf of the hundred million dead First Nation people and the Africans that were brought to this country as slaves. But I don't really know if that's true just came to mind 